I invited Chris to hack me uh, with his team. Um, but they're going to hack me using social engineering, which is essentially hacking without any code. They just use a phone and an internet connection. We help people with human security issues by testing vulnerabilities for, um, for like a network test, but it's for the people network. We test those vulnerabilities, see where the holes are, and then help people learn so they can patch them. Can we try some of this? Can we try some, yeah, see I mean, if it works? Yeah, we, we probably could uh, have our star visher here make some phone calls as <laughs> we go Let's do it. Sure, do you want to do a sample vishing call? What's vishing? Vishing is voice solicitation, and basically um, what you do is you use the phone to extract information or data points that can be used in a later attack. Let's do it. Will okay. you, who are you going to call? Maybe I'll call your cell phone provider okay. and see if I can get them to give me your email address. I, I bet they're good. I bet they have my back. <laughs> but yeah, go, go for it. I'm going to spoof from your number, so it's going to look like it's calling from you. Okay. Hi. I'm actually, I'm so sorry. Can you hear me okay? I, my baby, I'm sorry. <laughs> my... <laughs> my husband's like, we're about to apply for a loan and we just had a baby and he's like, get this done by today. So I'm so sorry, I can't I, um, call you back. <laughs> I'm trying to log into our account for uses information and I can't remember what email address we use to log the account. The baby's crying and um, can, can you help me? Awesome. In just 30 seconds, Jessica gets my personal email address. Um, now, if I needed to um, add our older daughter on our account so she could call in and make changes, how would I need to go about doing that? You would have to send me a secure pin through a text message? Yeah. Well, the thing is, I don't think I'll be able to receive a text message if I'm on the phone. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, I'm not on there either? I... So I thought when we got married, um, he added me to the account. Okay, my Jessica name. uses my girlfriend's name and a fake social security number 5127 to set up her own personal access to my account. Wait, I'm sorry, so there's no password on my account right now? Can I set that up? She no even gets the support daughter. person to change my password. Thank you so much for your help today. So she just no, basically blocked me out of my own account. I'll get her fed after this. <laughs> All right, thank you. Holy shit. So they they just gave they just gave you access to my entire cell phone account. You're gonna have to go on and change your password now because it's Jess, my name. And all it took was a crying baby and a phone call. Yes. I really thought that my cell phone company would protect me. I mean, like, this is the most basic stuff, and and they're not doing it. And if they're not doing it, you know, all these other businesses aren't doing it either.